Right. Five, four, three, two, one. Let the celebration begin in Seattle. It is over. The Seattle Supersonics have won the NBA World Championship Series in five games. He is square, and he's going to sample the mood of the crowd that's still growing in downtown Seattle. Andy? The world's champion Supersonics of Seattle, and everybody is going berserk. They're going up First Avenue, down First Avenue, everybody in the world down here is honking their horn. Here comes Sam Schulman with the trophy. Sam looks tired but happy. Here's Lenny Wilkins with him as they come off the plane. What a sight. The championship trophy of the world. Sam and Lenny bring it down the rampway to Seattle. Listen to this crowd. And there's Dennis Johnson. Jack Sigma. Dennis first down the ramp. Then Jack Sigma. There's Lonnie Sheldon. In the green shirt, Joe Hassett. Right behind him, Dennis Autry. After S. Dennis, there's John Johnson. There's Paul Silas. Right behind him, Dick Snyder. S. Then Wally Walker. Some estimates say 400,000, certainly more than a quarter million people squeezed into the downtown area. They lined the parade route up 4th and down 5th Avenues. That parade began at the Kingdom at noon. An ecstatic crowd swarmed towards the small antique cars carrying the players, the coaches, the staff of the team that came so close last year, then came back from defeat this year to take the title in just five games. By the time the cars got halfway down fourth, that crowd had turned into a crush. The cars crawled forward. The players shook hands, signed autographs until their hands and arms ached. In buildings lining the route, people hung out the windows, threw confetti, cheered themselves hoarse. In all this surge of humanity, there were nothing but smiles and the sign that we're number one. With the players on the stage at 4th and University, the fans once again gave them the cheer they've heard so many times before. Give me an S! Give me an O! Give me an N! Give me an I! Give me a C. C! Give me an S! Yeah. Now tell the whole world who's the world champion! The mayor gave Coach Wilkins a first, the keys to the city. The players all spoke, quietly, politely. But it was downtown Freddie Brown who probably summed it up the best. It's been a long time coming. And I know how all you feel, and I feel the same way that you do. And I just like to say, it couldn't have been better with a finer group of young men. It's what we have here in the organization. The two coaches, Frank, and my family, and all of you and the people who can't make it here today. Thank you very much. We deserve it. More than a quarter million fans agree. And that is how Seattle welcomed the world champions home. Jan Trollton, Eyewitness News.